Hi friends, it's me, Miss Heretic. Today's story is When Sadness is at Your Door by Eva Eland. Sometimes sadness arrives unexpectedly. It follows you around. And sits so close to you, you can hardly breathe. And you can try to hide it. But it feels like you've become sadness yourself. Try not to be afraid of sadness. Give it a name. Listen to it. Ask it where it comes from and what does it need. If you don't understand each other, just sit together and be quiet for a while. Find something that you both enjoy, like drawing. Listen to music or drink hot chocolate. Maybe sadness doesn't like to stay inside. Try letting it out sometime. When you feel sad, do you like a certain activity? Or do you like to talk to somebody? Go for a walk through the trees. You can listen to their sounds together. Sometimes getting fresh air really helps. Maybe all it wants is to know that it is welcome. And to sleep knowing it is not alone. When you wake up, it might be gone. Don't worry, today's a new day. I hope you guys enjoyed our story today and just know that if you feel sad, that it's okay. And sometimes you need to go outside, take a break, or talk to an adult. Bye guys.